Draga Stripes and welcome to Mace Migration. So in the last episode we built this little cabin thing here and honestly I really like how it turned out. It's just really light and airy and open and cute and tumblery and adorable. Anyway, so that was really good. And then I asked you guys for some suggestions for what we should build in this episode. And I decided to go with the purple and white house with a pool in the backyard. I don't know. I just thought that that would be kind of fun. And I know that's like, uh, that's kind of boring. It's like generic, but I'm going to make it fun. Hopefully I should not promise that, but maybe, I don't know. I just really felt like that would be a fun thing to build. And then also this is not pre-recorded, but the next episode is pre-recorded. So the suggestions that you leave in this episode, I won't use until like in two episodes time. So that the Wednesday after next Wednesday assuming that you're watching this when it comes out which is on wednesday if you're not watching this on wednesday then come to the closest wednesday and watch them okay i'm great at making sense anyway i want to make it i was thinking maybe just like right here and then we could have the road that kind of goes like that or something and all the two backs of the houses back to back why the heck is that doing that I don't understand. Anyway, so let's go ahead. Let's get some white and purple. So I'm not seeing a lot of options for purple, which kind of sucks. So we're going to go with this white. And I think that that dark brown looks kind of cool. So I'm not sure exactly how we're going to use it. But anyway, we do want a pretty decent sized backyard. So maybe we should have it like this. And then like we have the pool over there. Would that be okay i'm not exactly sure how to do it because this is like a weird space where we could do like i don't know it's interesting but then i have a i want to say good idea i don't know i'm excited for the idea of what we're gonna do right here so we're gonna have a really big window and then i'm thinking that the door might actually be like right like right over here or something i think that that will be all right i don't know if this looks kind of weird but we're gonna have like a little one right there anyway for the window we're gonna grab some glass and we're also gonna grab some stairs so this idea i saw somebody else do in a minecraft home and i thought that it looked pretty freaking awesome and so i really wanted to try it so basically you go like this kind of and i know that kind of sounds like boring or looks kind of boring but i also think that it looks pretty cool so we're gonna go with it we actually need full blocks because of the top thing i probably should have thought that out a little bit better but you know oh well i think that it will look pretty cute it's just light and beachy and fun and summery and whatnot so anyway then we're just gonna do i guess some paints there because why not and a little bit right here so i don't want this house to be like massive i think that is probably gonna be like somewhere around this big and then we're gonna have a way back and probably also stairs up here so anyway i want this to look kind of fancy uh i i don't know i feel like this could look really weird but it could also look super cute so we're gonna start by getting a little couch and then we're also gonna grab a carpet and i'm just gonna get a little light purple one so i think that this is the closest we're gonna be able to get to a light purple and it's kind of really intense and stuff but we'll go with it and i think for the floor we're probably for the floor i kind of want to go with this dark oak or this like that looks interesting and that looks really cool so i don't know if this is gonna look weird i'm pretty sure that it will look weird but like it's just the style of the people who live here this is what they want we're gonna go with it they just don't have enough purple things in this game oh maybe we should do a fireplace definitely to be honest i really want to do a fireplace so we're gonna have like a little one that's a lot bigger than a little and it doesn't fit hmm so this might look completely terrible and honestly it probably will i'm gonna go with it anyway or at least try it so we're gonna go ahead and we're gonna just oh this looks bad never mind that looks really stupid that looks really, really stupid. I want to make it symmetrical so we could at least do like a fish tank, but I don't know how. I mean, I know how, but I don't know how to make it symmetrical and decent looking unless we go like that and then we have the fireplace over here or the fish tank over here. That could look cool. Just have it kind of like built into the wall. That's fun. I like that. Okay. And then we're going to have like a little window here and maybe like add like a little chair in. Okay. Or not because it doesn't fit, but like that's kind of cool. And then over here, we're going to have a little kitchen and dining room area that can go out to the pool. So like I said, weird house it's fun though i'm just hoping that it will also turn out kind of cutish or at least not like an eyesore we shall see though also i'm not sure where the stairs are gonna fit in unless this could look so incredibly strange and just totally not work at all but 
if we go like this and it goes like upstairs, does that look really weird or pretty freaking cool? Cause I both love it and hate it. Yeah, that's kind of cool. So you can just kind of go up here and then I don't know exactly how we're gonna make the bedroom up there, but we'll figure out something and it will be pretty freaking epic. I'll probably also not have the floor this. I don't know what I will have the floor, but we'll figure that out later. I'm really happy with that. So now we can, I guess, fill this in. Now, I don't know if it looks better filled in or just like that type thing. I think that we might just leave it for now. Anyway, let's grab some counters. We're just gonna go with the crayfish stuff because you can't really go wrong with it. It's pretty good looking simple, but you know, clean and nice. I like it. So there we go. That's kind of cute. And I, like, I'm going to add, I think probably a blender in here. And then for colors, let's get like a backpack. And I want to have the dining room have some purple in. Anyway, let's put like the little backpack over there. You know, like you come in and they just kind of drop their stuff off. And then maybe like a little table. Let's do a stone one because why not? And then on it, we can just have a little vase of purple flowers. I feel like there should be something in the middle of this. That looks hideous. I mean, so does the rug to be fair. Maybe we can try it with this other purple. It's kind of nice, kind of disgusting. At the same time, let's try this lamp, which could look just hideous, but it also looks really, really hideous, I guess. I don't know, here's a little lamp. That's kind of cute. We're gonna go with it. And we will grab a fruit bowl because it does have a little bit of purple on it for the grapes. And we also need a table. Now I don't know how the heck the table is going to work. So we could do something like this. And I think that's the best that we might get unless we do it like that. But I think that we're just kind of gonna leave it like this. Definitely terrible, but I'm also kind of liking it at the same time. I'm not sure about that though. I think that maybe, maybe we'll just kind of leave this area clean and we can put the backpack like over here or something. Oh, or counter there. That looks odd though. And if we want, we could just kind of fill this in, you know? Like that doesn't look bad. Maybe we'll do that. Upstairs on the other hand, we still have yet to make the roof. So I'm not completely sure how this is gonna look. I kind of do want to like add that around though. Cause I don't know. I just feel like it fits well with the ecstatic, e ecstatic, I think is how you say it. Not ecstatic. I don't, I don't know what I'm saying um, of the house. I don't know. I just think it looks nice. Okay, for the roof, maybe we should try to find some sort of purple thing like we could go with this i think it's just clay but it looks nice or this might look even better just because like it matches that it's like both hideous but also nice at the same time or if we wanted we could do like this or just like a plain white maybe we should go with a white just clean and simple elegant almost i don't know i wanted this house to look like a little bit more like posh and rich people and stuffy than it does but i'm i'm still happy with it it's interesting this is really cool looking i'm happy with this this is like really bright and airy i'm pretty happy with it so we're gonna go ahead and we're gonna put like this railing along here and i don't know i think it's kind of fun and we need like a bed and stuff in here so we will of course go with a purple one because you know keeping with that theme yo oh and apparently also with the theme of like nothing fitting well, cause that's like a three thing and yeah, I don't know. There we go, that's okay. They just need to be careful not to fall cause you could really get hurt. And then I really want that chest that we didn't actually end up using in the other house. Uh, okay, here it is. So like that looks kind of cool. I'm thinking maybe we could stick it like over here. And then we have a little mirror, which I'm not really liking. We have perfume, which I'm not really liking. An alarm clock, which I'm not really liking a dream catcher, which I'm living for, and then a clock, which we can put over there. And I think that's about it. So I'm not sure if we should have that like over here or I don't know. I think that that's fine. Maybe we can put like the perfume on top of it. That's floating, that looks weird, no. But this is looking pretty decent, I feel like. I don't know, I'm happy with it. And then down here, it's a very small kitchen and a little bit of a cramped kitchen, but it's a good kitchen and it serves its purpose, I think. I haven't actually used it yet. But anyway, then out here, we're supposed to have a pool. Now, I'm not sure how that's going to fit in because apparently I did not leave enough space for it. So rip my hopes and dreams, I guess. We could do like a small thing over there. I don't know what we want to do there. Though so it's just, I didn't plan out this very well at all. Maybe we could, ooh, this could suck awfully but we could try 
because we have the space over there and we don't really have the space over here to just change this into like a big window or something to just change this into like a big window and then have the pool out front. That actually works pretty well. It a little bit annoys me because that's definitely not what I wanted, but it works. So we can just change this into like a little door, maybe make this not into a door. And then we could put the entrance to the house like right here, I guess. And what we could still do in the back is, cause there's a small bit of space, just have this hedged off. So honestly, there's not really a very good way to get to it. So I'm just gonna kind of like bring this over, you know, I don't know. It kind of worked and fill this up. So technically, I guess we could put a pool here, but I feel like it would be kind of stupid because it would be such a small pool. So we're just gonna go like this. And over here, I guess we could just have like a little deck with like a couple pool. Ooh, no better idea. And when I say better idea, it's basically the same idea. So it's not exactly better, but do like this. And then just put like a little purple umbrella on top. Oh, that's so cute. And over here, there can just be like a little bit of grass. So then we have like the little dining area and I think that I'm gonna change the floor for it. And then we can have like a little mahogany tree right here. Oh, this is so cute. And then let's grab some flowers. So you can have like some bluebells and some white, whatever they're called. And like a couple purple and more blue and white and stuff, that's pretty adorable. Now for the floor out here, should we just have it the same thing? I think that's actually okay. That's really adorable. I'm really happy with that. And the last thing I want to do is grab a little pot, grab some dirt, some stone, and last but not least, a little bit of lavender. So we can just have a small pot of that, like right on the balcony. And this is just so cute. So happy with this. Let's see, can we put a pot on here? Oh, cry. Okay, we can't, but this is like really fun. And I feel like these people would spend a lot of time outside, even though there's not a lot of outside, they'd still definitely spend a lot of time in the outside they do have. And let's just get some, so now we're just gonna get some water. And then I also grabbed like a couple of lily pads, which I would like to put on top just around, I don't know, I think it's kind of cute. And then maybe I can grab a couple lounge chairs. I don't know, put one like there and there or something that, looks really cramped there and there this is still looking so cramped because you can't really get to that one but like oh well we can grab some pots that was not what i meant to say i meant to say a pot okay drug addicts calm down anyway and then <laughs> let's get some uh, i guess the purple iris because that's pretty freaking adorable this is looking so nice I'm honestly really happy with it. Oh, and what I also want to do, and I don't know if we'll keep this because it look could, can't speak, because it could look very nice or very strange, is to put like a little lantern there. I'm not sure if that looks okay there. Like it should probably be up there or something. Yeah. And then upstairs, what about up here? I'm gonna go with the lighter one, I think. And over there, I know that's like the darker one and the lighter one and like kind of weird, but I like it more. So anyway, this is looking pretty good. We just need to work on the like entrance-ish type thing right here. Now I think that the road's gonna be stone and it's probably gonna go like right here-ish. I think that we're actually gonna make this a stone path that comes over here. Maybe what I should do, just cause it would give like a little bit more space is just go ahead and move this over. Cause then I feel like it could look a lot better, just less cramped and disgusting, I guess over here. Cause it is a little bit full. I'm just gonna put like a little bit of a gardeny thing here. There we go. That's really adorable. I'm pretty happy with that. That was an amazing suggestion. Thank you so much for that. Anyway guys, if you have any suggestions for what you'd like to see me build in the next episode, let me know in the comments down below. Congrats for making it all the way through this video. The next episode will be out Wednesday and I shall see you all later. Goodbye!